Hello guys, it's Skepicad once again with the last stand of and this video is actually going to go to the VIP section and I'm going to show you guys how to actually use that on the best, uh, actually the best way. I think um, when you're having a lot of spins uh, like I have, you're incapable of actually doing more uh, with the VIP. The VIP itself is going to be open when you actually use uh, money here in real life money. Uh, you get X amount of uh, points here. You can see this one right here, the Bunker Priority Package, is actually giving 100 points, and the Dog Breeding Package is giving you only 20. So you have to look through what kind of items you actually need, and then look for the one that actually gives you more points. Uh, I have got some of these right here, for example, the Room from 2.2 uh, Particles uh, boards that I actually use for upgrading the sector where I'm actually looking at this one right here, uh, the Settlement. Um, when you actually buy those, you get, uh, you can see 300 points, so that's actually a lot right there for the VIP section. Now the VIP section is going to open up for level 10. So when you're at level 10, you're incapable of going into the VIP section, and the higher you get, the more you actually open up. Now, you also got the brutalizer, so it's actually going to be worth it because it's actually going to give you the chance for doing the Bunker Bravo as well as other areas with the, uh, this brutalizer. It is a free gun and is located right here in the top uh, left, uh, sorry, right corner right here. This one right here, so if I'm actually going to tap this one, I'm not going to do that right now. But if I'm going to tap this, I'm going to get the brutalizer for 24 hours. Uh, sorry for, for X amount of uh, 24 hours, yeah, sorry, it's not 24 hours, it's only one hour, and it's actually going to be activated in that particular point. Now, what I'm actually using this VIP section for the most is the repair station. I'm using it for repairing all my weapons. You can daily do that, it's 12 hours, so there's two guns you can do for free every day, but you can also see there's actually points here. So it only uh, 100 smackers of these particular points here, 99 po points actually, uh, every time. And when you need those points, you get them from doing the spin right here. Now, this particular spin here, uh, you can also use the points for buying these ones right here. I'm actually using them a lot because that's actually giving me the transmitters here. You can see these ones right here are high value, in my opinion, when you're doing the ATV. I just build that. And actually gonna make some couple of videos on the newest area on and the swamp area. I'm looking forward for that actually. Uh, so let's just see here guys. Now I have a huge amount of spins. I got 91 uh, spins. So we're gonna do the spins here and I'm just gonna show you guys something before. I have the, my lucky rabbit on my backpack here. You can see this one right here. Uh, so let's is a black one. I don't know if that's lucky. I have no idea of that. See, I get a lot of guns here, get a lot of uh, weapons, I get a lot of, uh, yeah, uh, armor set as well as uh, these ones right here that I use in uh, anti-pills for doing the Bunker Bravo and Laboratory as well. So, let's just, just uh, do about this. I can actually not talk my way out of it. It's gonna be good here. The mystery box. We're starting up with the mystery box. Now, yes, you can see here, actually get the mystery box. I've got this one right here. And I don't know if I've got more here, uh, that, that's the worst part of it. Uh, we should actually take out some of the items here. I think we're going to take out these one right here. And all of the guns that we actually can carry on here. I'm just going to go up here so that is more uh, efficient what we're actually doing here. So you guys can see what kind of loops that I get on my next 90 uh, loops here. So let's see, we're going to fill up this one. I normally do this. Uh, I just just done uh, a video on on making um, uh, my um, uh, a raid. Sorry, guys, uh, a raid. And that particular run, I got some of these uh, bicycles uh, processes. You can see right there. I'm actually taking them every time I'm inside of that because I still need a couple more updates on my bike and my job. Here, you can see it's full upgraded on the back uh, back backpack or whatever it's called. Um, so let's just see here, we're gonna take uh, last parts here. So now it's only these one right here, that's more uh, convenient for you guys to see what we actually can get here. So let's just do 90 more spins here. See, well let's do the spins, I'm not gonna sing every time. Okay, that's uh, lazy, 40 smackers of uh, thins. We're actually using those for doing a lot. Oh, here we go, that's gonna start up. Pretty damn, damn good. 400 points, meaning that I'm incapable of making four weapons uh, usable in my 
Yeah, every time I'm actually destroy them. But when I'm doing the bunker driver, you guys have maybe seen the first video where I'm doing it. I'm dying so often in that particular video. Uh, but I'm learning it 100% now, so I'm actually not dying anymore. Uh, it is one of the spitters are actually the worst part of them. Every time I get these uh, coins here, oh, 800, that perfect. Look at the jackpot so near by. We've been looking for for the jackpot actually. So you get that, we should be in cable of mystery box, which is gonna open that, see what we've got in the mystery box here. Okay, we've got 400 smackers of these particular points here, and two of these uh, for making ourselves a treat of a meal for the dog itself. I'm looking for that. So an 82 more spin to go. So, um, one more mystery box, and I'm just gonna show you guys how you actually in cable are doing this. Now, this one is a gun, perfect, we got ourselves a shotgun. Now, uh, you might not know how to do this, so let's just see here. So to go to the VIP section, you can see here, I have had a lot of crazy, man. More than 170 days, uh, actually 176 days and six hours until my VIP status is actually disappearing. So that's never gonna happen. Uh, so what you can see here, this one right here, when you're at stage 10, you're incapable of activating the area with a VAP and your special instruction for one hour, blah, 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 and so on, so on. So all of these particular things here are giving you a chance for, uh, yeah, doing this uh, unlimited time. So every time you actually buy some more, you stack up with the spin. That's the only reason why I have so many spins. Otherwise, you actually get one spin for free every day. And these particular spins here are just uh, not stacking. So that means if you're not going in every day, you actually just lose that particular spin. Remember uh, these attempts that I have 78 back off. All of these particular uh, are stacked because I have bought something. I've got this one right here, so late. So that's the mystery box actually. I, I rather want to have the jackpot. The jackpot is so much better. Jackpot is giving you about four different kind of items here. Normally it suits mystery box. Let's just see. We got it just ourselves a little bit treat there. That's a good one. We like having to blast away all those zombies. Normally I use uh, hand grenades in Bunker Bravo. Uh, sorry, Bunker Alpha. And in Bunker Bravo, I use a lot of guns actually. Just gonna show you guys one of the most valuable guns in that area. Uh, when you're actually having, oh, we're not capable of seeing that, perfect. <laughs> Maybe we're gonna win it. Uh, when you're uh, doing the bunker problem, I can only recommend you do it when there's an event. Eight more guns incapable of doing that, perfect. We're gonna see in the end of this video here how many of these special points, yeah, coins, whatever it's called, that we actually get. We get 800 more right there. Those are the coins we're talking about. And those are so valuable, not just by uh, because they can buy a lot of items, but actually not capable of buying any items in that shot right there. You can see the guy standing. Uh, just another thing for you guys don't know anything about the VIP section. This one I'm talking about here, I'm not, I don't need to buy any more of these stuff here. Uh, the only thing I actually buy is um, uh, items that, that are, for example, this one right here is giving me uh, 20, of uh, these right here for free every time. So uh, you can see this one is upgraded with a special blowing and firing. So it's actually gonna burn the victim. That's so crazy. Let's see here. That was for a special event. And I found out that we were incapable of actually using it again by not destroying it and then re uh, repairing it. So and the funny part was before I actually got VIP, I had uh, never thrown away my weapon. So if they, the ability was almost done, I actually just went in and and ended up uh, putting me inside of my boxes here. Let's just see the two mystery th items we got here. Oh, now we're up with, that's a lot. I think I have about 10,000 of these. I'm actually gonna make a video where I'm just gonna talk through it. Uh, where it's out of spending, that's gonna be fun, guys. Because that's, there's sometimes some events where we're capable of um, getting a lot of points here. You're not getting any points for these things here, so this is not giving you anything. But these points right there are so valuable, in my opinion, so that we can make the weapons. And when, uh, like I said before, the Bunker Bravo itself, you are incapable of uh, using too many weapons. So if you don't have a VAP and don't have the repairing uh, bench, 
It is going to be very, very hot. Uh, I don't know if it, are we capable of buying a repair bench at our home base? That would be so crazy, man. Let's see here. Are we capable of getting that? Or am I thinking about Frostbond? Frostbond, you have the repair bench. I actually have the repair bench in Frostbond. Also, a, a VIP thing. It is this one right here. The middle room itself. That's so crazy building. I have a middle room all around my my recycling and metal area. We're not in keep of getting repair bench at our home base. That could be a nice upgrade, actually. So we don't need to go. It could just be the same like this one here. So we actually could. Don't need the VIP section, but they have made it so that we need the VIP section, and that's okay here. Look at my little rabbit. They're looking all around here, saying, "Cupcat, are you actually having a cat?" Oh, look at this. Love that. Steel plates. Those are the ones that we're talking about because these are actually giving me the chance for, um, yeah, doing uh, uh, the home base. So it's actually uh, getting more safe for the zombie attack. And it is 100% uh, safe right now. Uh, like I said before, I have um, iron all around. I just see no new use of actually wasting materials on building brick walls or upgrading even higher because you're never actually going to get attacked. The zombies are not going to come into your home base if it's bigger than Stonewall. Yeah, you heard that right. Uh, so you might gonna think, why are we going to make it an iron wall? Uh, the only reason why you're going to make an iron wall is because when you're doing raids, there are going to be a revenge rage at your home base at a time. And that particular revenge uh, rate is going to be in cable. Oh, we got ourselves some ass planks there. Uh, are going to be in cable of actually, um, yeah, um, destroying uh, brick walls. They're in cable of blowing up those brick walls. So they haven't made an update when you're uh, at this time actually going to be attacked uh, oh, perfect uh, some raisins here are actually going to make it easier when we actually restart areas um, but but what I was saying here is simply <laughs> I cannot focus sorry guys perfect steel ball um, yeah it's that when you need the <laughs> the iron wall is simply because you want it to, oh, sorry the steel wall is simply because you want want to have a, a secure home base so when people are attacking that they're not incapable of attacking um, uh, on a revenge uh, rate so yeah that's as, as simply as it is but it's gonna take you a long time building that uh, wall all around so if you're new in this particular game I definitely recommend that you that you just take it easy. It took me a couple of years actually building my home base and it took me a couple of years actually gathering these and uh, the only reason why I'm incapable of doing all this is because uh, I have the VIP right now and the VIP is just making it easier for me to assembling these particular things here. It's not because I don't recommend that you need to use money on it. I just recommend that you just play this game at the speed that you want to have it on. So that you're not wasting off valuable real life money here. Oh my god, mystery box, you see, we keep on filling this up. We also sell some treats here, that's so funny because I don't actually have my friend yet. I've been struggling, you, you don't know the struggling I've been through to gain my friend. I haven't got it yet, 24 more of these perfect little things there. I think it's a 50 of those. I actually need to restart the Bunker Bravo. And I did that a lot of times actually. Every time there were an event on that Bunker Bravo ever, I actually restarted it so that I got a chance for doing it. And you can do that a couple of times, I think it's about three times every time actually. So I now have uh, my ATV finished and that's so perfect. And I hope you guys want to see uh, videos on that area because that's actually, like I said before, took me a huge amount of time for those steel balls that we got there. Um, a lot of time getting it, so yeah. And as you can see here, I've been not spending my coins here, that's a uh, spin, spin, sorry. That's why I actually got so many, 91 spins, and there we've done that. So actually the last time I did this was a 40, or something, something like 50 maybe, I got 
so that you guys could see what 50 spins was. But this is actually giving me a crazy amount. I didn't get the jackpot yet. This is actually pretty annoying. Mystery bot. I'm gonna check that just in a while. I think after taking three. Ooh, that was so freaking close. 800 smackers there. We can actually get 1200. That's 12, 400 more. And eight plus four is actually 12. So that's uh, the same amount we got here. Eight more. Perfect. Keep on going with that. It's like the lucky string we're going at. 1200. Oh my god, there's so many. Perfect, perfect. Love this. <gasps> we got a jackpot! Let's just see what the jackpot actually gave us. Oh, it gave us this. Look at this. We got this, 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 and this. And now we got 2,200 smack of these points here as well. Oh my god, that was crazy. Now we got a lot of mo motorcycle uh, equipment in our inventory here. Oh my god, we don't even have the space for all of this. But let's just keep on going. I've been upgrading my chest at my home base as well. I'm also using that iron steel. Uh, not iron steel, steel um, at that point to get uh, all of those um, upgrades. I have it on the max, not maximum level, but I have it on the maximum level that I want. Uh, the next thing I need to upgrade is actually having more stacks in it, but you cannot stack your weapons. So that actually gives no sense doing that uh, or even trying that. So. I only recommend that you upgrade your chest to the point where you're not incapable of actually getting more slots. Uh, you should not upgrade it where it's actually going to cost you a lot of materials for getting it so that it will um, stack more on top of each other. Because weapons are not stackable. Remember that. Weapons are not stackable yet. They haven't done it yet, actually. I do hope that we actually get a better uh, weapon case or something. It could be a crazy good update, actually, when they're doing these special updates. Then so we got the refrigerator, we got the uh, tank for uh, gasoline and so on. And we got uh, uh, this area where we actually have all the materials with the planks and boards and stones and so on. And all of these updates they have made I do hope, oh, 40 of that is perfect. I actually do hope that they're going to make uh, it so that, oh, 24 more, so that we're capable of getting a uh, weapon stack on each other. That would be just pretty nice. So now we're going to the last 10 here on most. 11. And now the last 10. We're going to actually focus on this, guys. I'm going to look inside my inventory here just to see what we're going to get here. So let's just see this. Okay, stack like this now, so the points are like that. So let's just see if we're lucky enough to get a more one more jackpot, that will actually be good. And we almost did a hundred spins here, the guys, and we got one jackpot. That's freaking not amused here. 800 more, come on, keep on going, going with these. Actually, don't need the jackpot. I don't want these spin here to be points because they're much more valuable for me. This is not valuable for me at all. I do have so much gold right now. Got fluffy, damn it. Come on, give me some of these points here. 80, oh, that's so unlucky spinning. Oh my god. The last three spin, come on, give me some points here so we can show off the points. 24 of those, perfect. Give me one more. 24 more. Oh my god, we're going with the last spin here. Okay, we're going up and then we're gonna go in again just to hope that it's gonna. That's just the lucky thought I have right now. Come on, come on, come on, give me 200, my bare ass. Okay, so yeah, you can see there's a can down here, 16 hours uh, until we actually get a free spin. So let's just see what we got here. We actually got a lot of crazy things. We got 3,200 smackers of points here that we're gonna go on the other wheel. I got a lot of these here as well. Perfect, perfect. And a lot of crazy good things. And it's all of these things that I already have as well. And the best part is this one right here. I have 1,500. That's 150 guns. So you can see all of these guns here, all of these right here, all of the weapons that I have. If they are almost destroyed and the ability itself is going down on the damage here on the weapon, 
uh, and it's almost destroyed, I can then put it inside of here and tap that little skip button 150 times, actually 152 times. So that's 150 weapons that I'm capable of actually doing here. That's so crazy, guys. I've never actually been that high. Uh, I remember the last time I did this, I was uh, wending home to my, going home to my home base and actually repairing all of my weapons. Not None of my actually hand weapons here, I'm not using those much. I'm actually in all my videos almost never using hand weapons. Uh, the only reason where I'm actually using it is on the raids, because uh, I'm doing a lot, of, a lot of raids actually. And I hope you guys want to see the list of my raids, it is so huge right now. So I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, 91 spin here on Last on Earth. Hope you guys enjoyed this and see you guys next time. Bye bye guys. Remember a lucky rabbit here is giving you the points. That's not it's actually not a luck lucky rabbit. I think it's unlucky rabbit. I have no idea. Write that in comment if you guys know it. See you guys next time. Bye guys. See ya.